All right, guys, Mark Boy 316 here with another video, and uh, it's gonna be my five pack DVD uh, review series. And the first one I got here is the history of the WWE Championship. Always like the style of the packaging and uh, the book style, pretty cool. And we got some great matches on here. Some of them are, we got uh, some reading glasses here. All right, so we got Ivan Koloff and Pedro Morales. We got Bruno versus Killer Kowalski, Iron Sheik versus Hogan. Uh, King Kong Bundy and Hogan from WrestleMania 2 in the Steel Cage. Andre vs. Hogan from 3, just some of the matches. Uh, this 2, we got Hogan vs. The Warrior from 6. Bret Hart and uh, Owen Hart from SummerSlam 94. Brendan Shaw from 12, the Iron Man match. Uh, a lot of great matches on here. And then we do have this cool booklet here with uh, all the champions and stuff, that's pretty cool. Some stuff on the back you get or some of them you get uh, the championships all the different championships that is cool and on this tree you get cactus and triple h with my great street fighter rumble 2000 you get rock and kurt angle and undertaker from vengeance 2002 and some good stuff on there well yeah i got this when it first came out at a cd plus basically like an hmb and uh I pay full price for it. Still a great set. I think the best one out of the three is the IC title one. Uh, there's also a world title one, but the IC one, this one, is pretty good too. Great set to have. And here's one of my favorite guys. I kind of wish he, they would have released an ECW set of him, but uh, never more. The best of Raven. Always like Raven in ECW, WWF, and TNA in ECW. And uh, it's him, him against Jarrett for the world title. Him and Sandman in the House of Fun match. Raven and AJ Styles in a ladder match. Uh, we got uh, Raven, R Truth, AJ Styles, and Chris Harris in a four way match. And then, plus an added bonus, uh, Raven joins Debbie Taylor to provide exclusive commentary on matches against Wildcat, Chris Harris, and the phenomenal AJ Styles. So, this is a two disc set. Uh, very, very uh, cool one to have. It is a four hour runtime, and uh, this came out in 2005, and uh, awesome stuff. Then another one here, uh, great documentary, uh, discusses his life in length. And uh, as you see him here, there he is in his wrestling days. Then you see him down here in the wheelchair. You see him with his partner, Bruce Bulldog. It's the Dynamite Kid, A Matter of Pride. And this is a great stuff on here. Uh, this is from High Spots, obviously. And uh, you get a lot of cool stuff. It's approximately three hours long, so a pretty lengthy documentary. Open it up. It is a two disc uh, set. And in this one, I have a gentleman, a gentleman's choice, Chris uh, Adams, the guy who trained the uh, Stone Cold Steve Austin, or Stunning Steve, because they're both UK wrestlers. I figured I'd, I'd put it in there. So basically, made it like a three disc set. But yeah, uh, great uh, documentary on the Dunham White Kid. Highly recommend you get this. Got this on uh, eBay. Pretty cool. Then, like I said, I'm going to start incorporating movies in here, and uh, UFC, and uh, even the uh, video games. So, uh, here we go. G.I. Joe Retaliation with Bruce Willis and uh, uh, The Rock. And it's a steel book. So, there's the, the good old Blu-ray inside here. But love the case. Fantastic. Got this like for five bucks on the Facebook marketplace. So great stuff. Cool cover. Also like the back. That is cool. And it's a great movie. 
If you like action movies, you like the G.I. Joe franchise, highly recommend. And another fantastic movie. This is, uh, I do believe, around the time of WrestleMania 3, where he had the retirement match against uh, Adrian Adonis. Roddy Piper's in this movie. It's Day Live. Great stuff. And there's either this cover, if you like that, or that cover. It's a re reversible cover one. Always like those reversible covers. And uh, always cool to have. But I think I prefer that one with the aliens there going through the, uh, the glasses. That's pretty cool. Great movie. A lot of action scenes. A lot of good stuff. You see Piper there on the, on the back. There he is. Buddy Piper. And uh, yeah, this one. Is a pretty damn good movie, it's rated R, obviously. Uh, some good, good stuff. Looks like 1988, so yeah, 87, 88, because he, well, of course, around WrestleMania 3 is when he started filming it, came out in, in uh, 88. And uh, yeah, pretty cool uh, movie here. Highly recommend you check that out. So. Uh, that's my top five uh, classic stuff. Oh, I picked up that one at, uh, uh, off of uh, Amazon. It's like 10 bucks. So pretty cool. But uh, thank you guys for joining me. Uh, catch you guys in the next one.